we're excited to welcome a nearly full event and a reimagined event as we look towards the future of this event and the next 125 years of its history in this community. Whoop Up Days is coming back for another fun-filled year. The event coincides with the 125th anniversary of the Lethbridge and District Exhibition. Mike Morkington, the organization's chief executive officer, says the Pro Rodeo will also be making its way back to our city. We are going to be on the, on the Pro Circuit Tour um, and we will really have one of the greater opportunities late in the season to accumulate points to both those championship rodeos here in Lethbridge. So it's, it, it's incredibly important for the sport, but also incredibly important for us as an organization to reintroduce professional rodeo. Rides for Whoop Up Days will be provided by West Coast Amusements, and the Midway will be set up once again in our city. There will also be some new attractions coming up this year. One of our pavilions will turn into La Galleria, which is a celebration really of the local arts community. So very similar. We want to ensure that, that Whoop Up Days really is a, a spectacle for everyone to have something for. We're also introducing some indoor beach programming at the YQL Beach, which will be a full-on beach party, tiki bar, uh, you name it, in one of our halls. And then there'll be a saloon activation here in, in Heritage Hall. Whoop Up Days will run from August 23rd to the 27th, and the Pro Rodeo will begin on August 25th and run until the 27th. For Bridge City News, I'm Micah Quinn.